Hello everybody, welcome back again to this part of the drive. What I wanted to show you here, we're just sort of driving through a giant, giant group of wildebeest. They're spread out probably over a space of, I'd say, oh, I don't know, from where I can see here, say a thousand hectares or so, two and a half thousand acres, all of them shouting at each other. And there's one chap up here specifically, look at him there. This will be a bull trying to set up a temporary territory. He spotted a young bull in the territory and he's now chasing them out. And this is of course pointless because mating is long since over, but the bulls do do this from time to time. And his territory will disappear as fast as his herd moves on, so it's completely transient. I'm imagining that there must be a pride of lions around here somewhere. That is our objective, is to find a pride of lions interacting with this herd. And the reason for that, of course, is that we want to see how the predators are enjoying the migration. Let us continue. Ah, Bill, you want to know if royal antelope are found in the Mara? Bill, they are not found in the Mara. Um, I'm just going to check where they are found for you. I'll just get my book out. And for those of you who don't know what a royal antelope is, I'll show you a picture of it. Excuse me, just taking all my kit out. Uh -huh. This is the best book for that. Eh, for antelope. Her for royal. Antelope. One second, everybody. You just didn't, we don't need to look at me, Vim. We can look at the, the wildebeest migration. Or we could just look at me. That is your favourite, isn't it? you find that very funny indeed. I can't find the royal antelope. I've seen it many times in this book. Ah, here we go, royal, 2.44. Phew! Thank you, Vim. Thank you so much. All right, there is the royal antelope there. It is a tiny, tiny little thing. It is a, uh, well, I guess I suppose you could think, it, think of it as a, a sort of a diker. Very closely related to the diker, and it's found only in West Africa there, around the Ivory Coast. There we are, and Togo, Benin, Nigeria, that sort of area there. In fact, it doesn't occur in Togo or Benin. I can see both of those. Anyway, West Africa. Royal antelope sounds like it should be something the size of a sable, but it isn't. Let us just take one moment to appreciate the sounds. sound that you can hear is the sound of the wind that's coming up and well the last few in fact I think just about every single afternoon I've been out here we've had a th thunderstorm of some sort and yesterday Fergus and I uh, very nearly got caught in a horrendous storm anyway we managed to stay clear of it and we're going to try and do the same today but there is a storm brewing over to the far sort of north east there one bring over the mountains there to the west and uh, hopefully nothing to the south of us so we'll keep going that way the roads here in some areas are not particularly impressive so it is a little bumpy and i apologize for that Ooh, there are some bulls having a fight there we go the fight is over but tristan is not uh, without the same thing that he has been with all afternoon. <laughs> 